back. Hollywood Fringe is almost here. The festival is the creative breeding ground for talent like Late Night's Amber Ruffin and Ted Lasso's Brendan Hunt. That's right, and now it's celebrating 14 years of live theater with more than 400 shows. Joining us with the preview co-executive producer Lois Neville and Ellen Boudreaux, Den Herden. Good morning, both of you. Good morning. <laughs> Good morning. Yeah, give us an overview. What is the Hollywood Fringe Festival? I like the name. It's right, it's a great start. Yeah. Uh, so we're an open access annual theater arts festival celebrating theater in Los Angeles. Right? It's, a, it's a film and TV town, so we really yeah. like to shine the spotlight on theater uh, for one month every year. Okay, right. so now let's talk about what kind of performances we're going to see as part of this year's Fringe Festival. There's something for everyone at Hollywood Fringe. Um, so you have everything from the, your traditional theater in a black box with about 100 seats, all the way down to like a more intimate 20-seater. Um, um, and then you have things like immersive theater, interactive performances. Um, we have um, even an escape room this year. Oh. So we have so much uh, to do. There's a little bit of something for every type of person. Yeah. yeah, and I think that's good. You don't just offer shows, right? You're all about helping the artists in what way? Absolutely, we're a community-centered festival. So on top of, of course, being a platform mm -hmm. for performance, which is so important for both audience and artist, mm -hmm. but we're a space for them to join together and build their careers because of networking and education, because yeah. uh, it's hard to be an artist. And so we yeah. want to create that safe space for them to really hone their craft mm -hmm. and uh, create careers. Especially somewhere like LA, which is so spread out just as a city. It doesn't have the mm -hmm. density of other cities or the natural meeting places, but you have a brand new central hub, which you are calling Fringe Central. Where is it? What can people find there? Yes. On Hollywood and Highland um, at the Ovation Center, we have our central box office, which is also a meetup space for our artists and industry base, where our artists can mix and mingle. And if you're an audience member, come and buy a ticket to a show, get to know the artists. Um, they'll always be around. Um, yeah, yeah, and we have a box office, so if the festival is a little overwhelming, right? We talked about 400 shows, almost 2,000 performances. That's a lot. And that so is a lot, yeah. <laughs> you, How do you choose, right? Yes, exactly. So if you need a tour guide, our box office is there, and our team is ready to help you navigate to find the shows that are really going to speak to you. How important is it to what you guys are doing? How important is diversity in all of this? You're talking about racial diversity, gender diversity, when it comes to the artists, especially here in town, like we were talking about, like it is a diverse community, but oftentimes people in the industry may not feel like they're represented. So what are you guys doing to combat that? Yeah, it's so important, right? The audience needs to see themselves, and then we need to see people that, you know, are going to open up our understanding of life, uh, and we have great programs. Yeah, it's pivotal to our festival. We have our scholarship program, which is a um, grant program to help BIPOC um, folks be able to enter into the festival. We also have a low-income Angelino Artist Fund, mm. where we fund low-income Angelino's work. And so for us, it's about making an accessible platform mm. so that everybody can see their stories represented on stage and everybody can buy a ticket to go see that show. Our average ticket price is $15. Oh, nice. Um, so that anybody can come in and be able to experience live theater. And before we go, what's your elevator pitch for why theater is important here in LA? Yeah. In LA, I mean, it's everything, right? Theater is the human experience. Mm -hmm. And so we're so excited to be able to invite audiences at an affordable price to experience life uh, with, it, with the community. Mm -hmm. Live theater, it's a lot like live television in a sense, right? Like things <laughs> yeah. are happening. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> How do you have those organic conversations? I'm all about it. Thank you so much for being here today. Hollywood Fringe Festival opens June 12th with shows running through June 30th. For tickets and details, look at our screen right now. Write it down, put it in your phone, or you can head to hollywoodfringe.org. Dance it out. We'll be right back. This is live theater, baby. Yeah. <laughs>